Hi, welcome to Answers Q. Press the subscribe button and the bell icon to get more updates about free online courses, course answers, and internships. Hi, friends. Welcome to this video. In this video, we are going to see some free software development courses that are available on LinkedIn Learning. Before going into the video, if you haven't subscribed to our channel yet, kindly press the subscribe button and the bell icon that appears after that, so you'll get a notification whenever I upload a video. And you can also connect with me on social media platforms like WhatsApp, Instagram, and Telegram. I'll give you all the link in description check it out so let's go back to the content of this video now so before we see the courses i would like to tell you one thing the courses that we are going to see in this video are already available for free so you don't need to pay for anything or else you don't need to use your free month trial so just have a linkedin account if you don't have just create a linkedin account and you can straight away enroll in these courses and are open for free we all know that software development has been one of the most popular career choice by a lot of people all around the world and the demand for software developers is still growing and it's only expected to grow even more in the future and why do people always choose software development i mean why do a lot of people choose software development uh, as a career choice they have two main reasons one is the technology advancement that we are getting year by year it's going to boom the technology is going to boom and we are going to face a lot of uh, few new technologies in the future and the second thing is you have the amount of money that a software developer can earn so we all know that it's a very high paying career so if you are looking to learn software development and become a professional software developer then you should definitely check out these courses on linkedin that are available for free to become a software developer and learn the skills needed for it so now let's take a look at what are the courses that are available for free and these courses are free and you can also get a free certificate once you complete these courses you don't need to pay for the certificate or the or the course it's absolutely for free so the first one is programming foundations fundamentals so you can see the instructor of this course and see davis and she is a software developer so you are learning from a professional so you don't need to worry about the quality of content that you are going to get and on the left side you can see the contents that is what you are going to learn in this course programming basics syntax data types and variables conditional code modular code and a lot more and here you can see the exercise files and certificates everything you can simply click on show all so once you complete this course that is watch all the necessary videos and if you have any quiz take the quiz and once you complete all the necessary contents you can click on show all near the certificates so let me click on it so for this course you can get linkedin learning certificate once you complete the course it will become available that is the download button will become available you can click on it and download your certificate once you complete the course so this is the first one programming foundation fundamentals let's move on to the next one this is programming foundations databases so instructor is scott simpson and you can see he is an author at linkedin so you are always learning from a professional you don't need to worry and here is what you'll be learning in this course database foundations tables relationships database optimization querying a database querying a database so there are two topics i hope everything is different and once you complete it you can download your certificate click on it and you can see here linkedin learning certificate you can click on download once you complete the course and you can then share the, those certificates on your resume or your profile and if you scroll down you can see the course details like the duration so for this one you have 1 hour 25 minutes of content and it's a beginner level course and you can also see the date in which the course got released and other uh, details like the learning objectives skills that are covered in this course is given so you can see all those things once you scroll down and the next course is uh, succeeding in web development full stack and front end so the instructor is ray and you are going to learn again from a senior staff instructor at linkedin learning and here are the course details so you have one hour third, three minutes of content and and it's a beginner level course you have these things to learn here developers life core technologies core concepts supporting technologies education and getting a job so all these things will be covered in this course next one is html essential training so you should definitely learn html if you are learning software development it's no doubt and you can see the instructor and their uh, profession here and this course is 2 hours 45 minutes long and it, this is also a beginner level course and you can see all the things that you you are going to learn in this course like uh, formatting text understanding the power of html linking and navigation images and graphics on all the things are given here you can just look into it 
so this is html course next one is css essential training so this course is taken by christina and you can see the duration is four hours 28 minutes and you can see what are the things that you'll be learning that is learning objectives and the skills that are covered in this course and here you can see certificates so once you complete it you can click on it and download your certificate so these are the things that you'll be learning in this course box model core concepts typography layout float and positions layout flexbox and grid so let's move on to the next one javascript essential training so this course is taken by morton rank and the duration is 5 hours 32 minutes and you will be learning about the basics working with data functions and objects javascript and the dom project creating an analog clock so all these things are covered in this course you can just see the contents and once you complete it you can click on show all near certificates and download your certificate here your download button will become available once you complete the course and the next one is learning python so this is no doubt you should definitely learn python it's becoming a more and more powerful lab programming language these these days and it's taken by joe and the duration is 2 hours 27 minutes and most of these courses are beginner level so even if you don't know anything you can still dive in and learn it so these are the things that you'll be learning basics working with data and times and working with files everything is given here next one is learning java this course is taken by Catherine hodge and she is also a software developer and the duration of this course is 2 hours 39 minutes so this is also a beginner level course and you can see what are the things that you'll be learning once you complete the course you can click on show all here near certificates and download your uh, linkedin learning certificate so let's move on to the next course now uh, c sharp so this is learning c sharp course with alex so this course duration is three hours four minutes so you have to spend around three hours for this course and here are the things that you'll be learning advanced concepts of c sharp uh, top new features errors and debugging basics so all these things will be covered and you can click on show all and download your certificate once you complete the course content next one is learning sql programming so this course is taken by scott simpson and the duration is 1 hour 27 minutes and again it's most of the courses are beginner levels so <laughs> once you complete the course you can click on show all and download your certificates so for this course you have two certificates one is a linkedin learning in certificate and the other one is nasba certificate for so for getting your nasba certificate you should pass the exam with a score of at least 70 percent if you want nasba take the exam so let's move on to the next one next one is programming foundations web security so this is taken by kevin founder of nova fabrica and here is the course details the duration is 2 hours 17 minutes and it's a beginner plus intermediate level course and once you complete it click on show all and download your certificate and here you can see the learning objectives and the skills covered so web application security that you might know from the name itself and here is what you'll be learning security overview general security principles filter input output most common attacks so these are the things that will be covered in this course and once you complete the course content you can click on show all here and you can download your linkedin learning certificate the download button will become available after you complete the course so these are the 11 courses that are available for free for software development now so make sure that you are using these courses and learning software development so i hope you all like this video to get more updates about free online courses course answers and internships subscribe to answers and press the bell icon i have given a link in description check it out and you can also connect with me on social media platforms i'll give you the link in description check it out don't forget to like this video leave a comment if you need anything and share this video with your friends and thank you so much for watching this video